In this video I'll show you how to connect your iPad Air or iPad Pro to your Samsung Smart TV using an HDMI cable. So let's get started right away. So the iPad Air and iPad Pro is using a USB Type-C port at least uh, for the last four years and the way to do it you'll need a USB Type-C adapter to HDMI. Now, not all of these will work. I'll put a link in the description if you want to get this one, which I think is quite cheap on Amazon. And, and I'm using it to connect my MacBook to a TV very often. And it also works with uh, the iPad. So you just need to connect over here. And on the other side, you need you just need a HDMI cable. Again, I'll put a link in the description. You also support my channel when you check those links. Connect one end here go on the back of your Samsung TV and usually you should have two or three HDMI ports and you can connect to no matter which one. It does not matter if you choose number one, number two or number three. In my case, I'll put it in number one. Like this. Once you do this, take your Samsung remote control, no matter if it looks like this one or not, and press uh, the home button or the source button. And uh, if you press the home button, you need to go using the, the left side arrow until you select source. And now you're going to select the HDMI port where you connected your iPad, in my case, the HDMI one. And here we go. Automatically, you should see appearing the same exact thing that is on the display of your iPad. And now the iPad is a bit awkward to use in this position since it does not use the full width of the TV. So let's say I'm using this app. You can always switch it on the other side if the app is supporting this to see full screen or almost full screen. If you're looking at some pictures on your iPad, you can also zoom in on them. And this way it will take, you see, the full screen of the TV and you won't have those annoyings, uh, annoying bars on the side. You see, if I zoom in really. Once you're done, you simply need to disconnect. You need, don't need to go in any sorts of menu on the iPad or even on the Samsung TV. You just unplug it from the iPad. And then the Samsung TV screen will turn black because nothing will be connected to that HDMI and you simply need to select another source so you can go to any apps and just start using the TV you usually do. Thanks for watching. I hope this was useful. Again, check the Amazon links in the description. You're supporting my channel by doing this and uh, leave a like, comment down below and I'll see you in the next video.